So here are some key terms from that video, some really important things to pay attention to that are used oftentimes on test questions. Mm -hmm. So for basal cell, the key words to pay attention to, oftentimes they'll say they have pearly borders, Ooh. or it's pearly, or don't get tricked. They might have used the word iridescent, iridescent. or translucent, flesh colored. I always say they describe basal cell nicely. It's the <laughs> nicest one to get. And so they'll say rolled edges, slow growing, raised. Um, and again, it's described very nicely. It looks kind of pretty, that translucent, iridescent, rolled edges. Okay. And it's the nicest one to get because it, like you said, it usually does not metastasize. So it doesn't spread. So the B9 is like the B nice ones. Yes. And so it's painless, it's pearly, pearly. it's like one of those wedding rings or engagement rings. It's like they went to Jared's. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now moving on to squamous cell findings. Mm -hmm. So the key words to write down here, scaly cap or crust. So Ooh. now it's starting to sound a little bit worse. Yeah. Squamous is a little bit worse to get. Okay. Because sometimes it can metastasize at times. And be cancerous. Yes. Not deadly. Okay. So we do want to catch this early and usually we will cut it out to get rid of it to make sure that doesn't happen. But they'll describe this squamous cell has a scaly cap or crust. So I think squamous, scaly. Ooh. So like a little bit of like a crust to the top. Oftentimes they'll say it's volcanic or kind of have, has a little pit to it. Mm -hmm. And that it has a firm nodule or erythema, redness. Mm -hmm. So I think like a volcano with a pit and that red lava around it. Oh, yeah. And volcanoes are firm. If you tried to touch them, they'd be firm. Yeah. <laughs> so scaly cap firmness, that volcano with that red lava around Ooh. it, and that erythema, so that erythema, mm -hmm. and then a little bit of a pit to it. Yeah, it doesn't sound nice at all. It's, no. Yeah, the uh, the benign one sounds very nice, very pearly, very engagement ring, Jared's type. This one sounds like the end stage of Super Mario. <laughs> right. It's horrible. And so, and the big thing there is they can metastasize. So we do cut them out. We try to make sure that we get as much of it as we can, and then we watch for any um, further ones to occur. So as you guys know, remember, metastasize just means movement. So these little cells can break apart, and then that's how cancer spreads around and moves around the body with metastasis. Hey everyone, Nurse Mike here from SimpleNursing.com. Did you get your beautifully handcrafted study guide bundle yet? It highlights the key points and memory tricks in this video. Plus, get 900 more videos not here on YouTube, all neatly organized in the playlist, along with thousands of practice questions written by actual NCLEX writers. So don't be scared, be prepared. Try it free today. Visit SimpleNursing.com. And so finally, we have our scary one. Uh oh The malignant melanoma. Oh, man. So the keywords here are going to be those ones that break those A, B, C, D, E rules. Okay. They're going to be asymmetric, border irregularity. Mm. They'll have color variations, and it might say red, black, blue, purple, just any color variety. We like them to all be, you know, the same color, oftentimes chocolate brown in color. Okay. So we don't like those color variations. This seems like a lot's going on, right? Asymmetrical, so it's not like a perfect circle. Right. Borders irregular, so that's not regular. Color variations, right? So it's like all these things are changing. We don't like a lot of changes. Absolutely. And the other thing we don't like is the D. We don't okay. like the diameter to get bigger than an eighth to a fourth of an inch. Mm -hmm. So I always like to think in my head, that's the end of a pencil eraser. We don't want it to get bigger than the end of a pencil eraser. Okay. And then finally our E. I've heard of E used in a few different ways. We don't want it to be elevated. We don't want it to have exudate or be bleeding or oozing. And then we don't want it to be ever changing or evolving. Mm. So oftentimes we'll ask patients like, how long has that been there? Or has it always looked that way? Have there been any changes recently? Uh, because that can be a sign of concern. And so these ones, unfortunately, typically you have to do chemo, sometimes radiation, surgery, if these are found, not just cut them out. So melanoma typically means a cancerous, yes. deadly yes. condition. So remember guys, on your NCLEX as well as most nursing exams, we don't like changes or sudden changes or rapid changes. These typically indicate a critical client. So if you guys see any words like irregular borders, asymmetric, color variations, diameters that are increasing or elevations, this is not normal. These are very sudden changes. So we have to report this immediately. Mm -hmm. 